and after that I plonked myself the next day early morning I was out in that curfew situation reporting if you have so the guts to do it if, if you have the guts to do it you will do it no it's, it's not because right. everything you, you, you may have the guts you may have the guts to yeah. do it you will be out there in the field his point is very very simple so you are making a valid point I'm not saying you are not making a valid point there are situations where I have been there with women journalists and they have gone out to the front and the situation has turned ugly and we have had to withdraw them and then send in the guys there so that kind of a situation has happened no i mean it it would be foolish for us to go and sit and wait for her to dominate the situation and mm-hmm. somehow be able to control it's it it would be foolish for us to wait for that situation right. so like you have to get it's, it's it's good if you're chivalrous it, it's very really good if you're chivalrous it's just about ensuring the safety and security yes, in a certainly. situation which yeah. cannot be controlled but i think hmm. we a person is responsible for himself or herself of course yes right yes, no but you know when you went things. okay chandra Chand, Chand, when you went to do the story You, nothing happened i mean I, i we all have done certain studies in yeah. the middle of the night and we've done yeah. that was it pure pure luck you felt that nothing happened or was there an apprehension no. that something could have gone wrong uh, you see uh, and this is not the first time i have yeah, uh, yeah, encountered yeah. this kind of yeah. situation even otherwise even you know they have gone go to very remote the job demands you to do all of that right. yes we all do it yeah, you know yeah, yeah. a lot depends on how professionally you yourself conduct yourself uh, conduct yourself right once you demonstrate that listen you are here to do a job oh. you are not here for a picnic mm. then the people who are on the other side whether it is men women they're villagers they are standing in the same right. right. i'm going to take i'm going to just going to take a very short break but we'll be right back to discuss how much of professionalism a woman has to put in her field that's after this break Welcome back. Well, we are discussing a very interesting topic. How difficult, how easy is it for women to be journalists? Shaida, you you had a very interesting point to make just before we went into oh. the break. हाँ जी. मैं ये कहने लगी थी कि जो भी काम की दिक्कतें हैं, वो सबके साथ हैं और हम वो जानते हुए उस फील्ड में आ रहे हैं. हमें मालूम है मुझे कश्मीर भी जाना पड़ सकता है गुजरात कहीं भी जाना पड़ सकता है उससे कोई मना भी नहीं कर रहा है इसके बावजूद ये सब तो हम कर ही रहे हैं ना उसके बावजूद वो नंबर हमारा जो सबसे वैलिड जो, जो डिस्कशन का पॉइंट है वो यही है ना कि हम ऊपर जाने में कितना फास्ट है हमारी जो स्पीड है वो कितना रुक के जा रही है अगर आप एंट्री लेवल पे देखें उससे थोड़ा ऊपर के लेवल पे देखें बहुत जबरदस्त काम हो रहा है प्रिंट में इलेक्ट्रॉनिक में सब जगह आप देख लीजिए पर बात वही है कि सीनियर लेवल पे जाने में जो स्पीड है वो उतना फास्ट नहीं है कहीं पे भी वो क्वेश्चन तो वहीं पर है इवन द स्टोरीज वेन यू गो आउट टू डू स्टोरी तब भी हमें मुश्किलें थोड़ी सी ज्यादा है वो बिल्कुल कुछ दिक्कतें होती हैं वेन यू गो आउट टू डू समिंग हार्ड वेज टू गेट डिफिकल्टी सी दैट सेम थिंग विच वी वर डिस्कसिंग अर्लियर वन ऑफ द रीजन इज कि ऊपर जाने में प्रॉब्लम ये भी आती है कि द वुमेन पुल्स आर सेल्फ बैक अनादर थिंग इज दैट फॉर द एडिटर और वे वॉज टेकिंग अ डिसीजन ऑन प्रमोटिंग यू ही ऑल्सो सीज दैट यू नो वेमेन आर नॉट द प्राइमरी ब्रेड विनर्स इन इन देयर होम सो यू कैन गेट आर नाउ दे आर बट स्टिल आई वुड से इवन नाउ द परसेंटेज इज स्टिल लेसर सो द पीपल हु आर डिसाइडिंग योर वेजेज और हू टू प्रमोट दे कैन गेट अवे बाय even paying you less one hmm. and maybe and maybe you know um, uh, kind of overlooking you in favor of somebody else ki oh she is not going to make so much of a noise, noise. even yes. if she is not promoted it yes. doesn't matter yes no i don't think so kyunki uh, ek example lijiye abhi punjab elections hue mm-hmm. i've been uh, there th- throughout the elections two three months hmm. aur uh, last mein maine apne editor ko ye kaha ke hmm. 6th march ke baad 7th ko hmm. आपने मुझे एक बार भी फोन करके ये नहीं पूछा कि कोई प्रॉब्लम तो नहीं आ रही है सो कॉन्फिडेंट अबाउट इट कि अच्छा uh-huh. तुम बादल गांव जाओगे तुम लंबी जाओगे तुम uh-huh. ये करोगे तुम वो कभी उन्होंने पूछा नहीं है सो अगर नहीं पूछने की जरूरत क्या है यू डू इट आई थिंक वी टिल नाउ वी कम विद सर्टन कल्चरल बैगेज बट नाउ थिंग्स आर गोइंग टू चेंज एंड वी गोइंग टू सी द चेंज है in the next 10 to 15 years this is going to be a very visible change you yeah. know like i would like maybe to, i would like to kind of i would like to say that in our like i mean because i i can only mm-hmm. refer to electronic media in yeah. in our system it's it's expensive to have a woman journalist but still they happen to be now kind of in proper numbers visible. and more because a woman journalist goes out into the field to report she has to be accommodated in a separate room the cameraman has to be accommodated in a separate room there are costs involved yes. while if, if a guy reporter goes mm-hmm. out both are in the same room yeah. so but despite that organizations are kind of ensuring that women are out there because they are competent so the organizations are also ensuring the organizations are also ensuring yes. because it's more pleasant to see a woman yes, yes. yes. that's the yes. point yes yes, yes. yes. if yes. you were not yes. beautiful yeah. out there yeah. that yeah. a boring person yes. you know who's looking all jaded 
I, generally? I wouldn't say because we, it, in, in our system, I, I would say it's, it's very merit oriented because uh, it's not as if people are kind of judged on the basis of their looks. And no, that's the thing is that the media is a very visual. They're definitely judged on the basis of their ability to communicate, but not on the basis of their looks. And if the woman can pack in her ability to communicate, her ability to report, as well as, look, woman woman screen, better as, well as look good on screen, <laughs> then you've got the whole package happening. Absolutely. Yeah. So what's wrong with that? I mean, at the end of the day, men and, and women and are and different. They have their pluses and their minuses, and that's what life is all about. Thank God they're different. Thank God they're different because that makes the world so much more beautiful. Um, yeah. Absolutely, obviously. Yeah, yeah electronic <laughs> media, yes. I would agree with Rajni to a large extent. If you are good looking, and that is a primary reason why women, why you see more women on 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 the screen, yeah, on yeah. television, which you wouldn't in journalism. But when you are going out to do, how many in in, in your local uh, in in Chandigarh or in our region, when you go for a press conference, how many women do you actually see there? Lots of them. Very large number. Fair amount. Yeah. 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 Almost you won't say fifty fifty. Yeah. Maybe yeah. sometimes it is. Uh, maybe more. Maybe more. Maybe more. Maybe a lot depends on what kind of press conference. Press conference. Is, it a, is it a political one or maybe a lifestyle or a hotel yeah. opening? Yeah. Even political is like about forty percent would I'm be political. Political. I'm yeah. political. I'm talking yeah. about political. Yeah, I'll add to that. Like if if you see uh, uh, the kind of composition in Delhi or in safe urban centres like mm -hmm. Chandigarh, you will suddenly see that there are more women out there. Right. But when you go out into the Mufassal yeah. towns, when yes. you go out into the kind yeah. of urban areas, uh, into the rural areas, you will suddenly see that it's totally male dominated. Now that's a social kind of a thing that. That's where the challenge is. There, the change is waiting to happen. Yes, there how, many, really how many women happen. stringers have you ever heard of? See, they are not as How many women stringers do you have? How many women have you ever heard of? We do have. We do have. Uh, lesser number. Where are trainees going? Uh, I am here, I am here. No, there are many people who work in a lot of days. They are very mature journalists. But the question is that they will be with their husband. Yes, they will be with their husband. Haan. See everything oh, is the 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 urban the centers the which usher in the change and then mm -hmm. the change goes down. Yes. You know, it flows down. And you see the change happening in the Mofasil towns too. Women have to fight against the system out yes. there. Yes. They are fighting. It's not easy. It's not a platter. They have to move on. 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 That's true of no, all professions. Yes, Why should we be a single out journalist? Yeah, but in, but in journalism, it's it's at the end of the day, there is certain amount of risk involved because you are uh, you are looking for a story that's anti-establishment, anti-somebody, yes. there's, there's something yes. that's going wrong and there yes. for a woman to be out there and trying to fetch that story, there's a certain amount of risk involved I would, which I would is more for a woman than yes. for a guy. Yes, the risk is there, hmm. but there too the scene is changing. Women yes, are is. willing to take the risk. Yeah. Yes. And a woman who proves herself, you know, when she's rising up the ladder, when hmm. she's climbing the ladder, a woman who proves her ability at the lower rungs will be recognized ultimately when she goes I was higher. just talking about Hisar which scared the hell out of me hmm. and uh, the contributor for us from Hisar is a woman and hmm. she always gets us the news and she's been safe and sound I mean touch wood and uh, she, she's an excellent kind of resource yeah, for us out so there in Hisar. Right, no? Because so, she's yes. learned how to get around these problems. Yes. But when there are those kind of slightly awkward situations we have to kind of ask her to and, kind of step and back if, and then we can. And if a woman doesn't step off the ladder herself, if the woman steps off the ladder herself then, hmm. then who is going to put her at the top? But mm -hmm. if she doesn't step off the ladder herself, she will rise. If mm -hmm. she won't rise in your organization, she's going to rise elsewhere. Shaida, when you come to the studies, and not in your earlier experience, or when you look at women per se, do you have any judgment that what will happen to her? Male colleagues have that all the time. Allah, what will she know? No, sir. For news, I'm talking about hard news. I'll have a better angle. She'll just do the fluff, flutter her eyelashes and come out. No. Do you, do, you, do you get that feeling sometimes that, oh, she won't have much? No. Uh, we have very able journalists, very able women journalists who would have proved everybody wrong on this. They may have assumed when she entered the room, yes. ki, yes. but, but, but that, that judgment is that, that by the time she would leave, yeah. you would have your notion of that. See, until, yeah, that, that's just there initially. But mm. once she begins her work, mm. I think everybody realizes yes. that. But yes, the feeling is real. Like that 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 look at I am amazed at how you all are like saying no, no, no. That feeling is so predominantly there. What does she know? You know, I you always come across as this, and then you have to go about proving yourself. Well, you don't have to. You don't have. You to. don't have, you have, have to. You have one step. The beauty is the beauty is that you'll have a man sitting, and you'll say, "Wow, isko kitna jada pata hoga." And the moment he opens his mouth, you find he's a fool. And we have women journalists right here in Chandigarh. You know when Chandigarh went for the Amarnath Yatra. Hmm. We all were here in Chandigarh. She went with Talwarji hmm. and we all were so proud of her and every day we would get hmm. reports. Hmm. Ki Talwarji or Chandar yahan pahunche hai, aaj wahan pahunche hai. We would have reports coming in, reports hmm. appearing on page one every day. Hmm. We all were so proud of her. Hmm. So is there, is there stopping in able is there, is there that pre-judgment? Yes, so. there is because I was uh, just listening to um, an interesting conversation between Madhu Trehan and Sagrika Ghosh, yeah. who's in our channel, and uh, yeah. they were talking about uh, on news laundry. Mm -hmm. So they were uh, talking about uh, the preconception that 
when Sagarika Ghosh does face the nation and when, when mm. she kind of grills people who are an equivalent and uh, who are dominant mm. kind of, uh, you could say alpha males rather, mm. I mean they are in dominant positions and when she questions them, she says that she finds it, that they find it odd that a woman can, can put, put such put questions, questions to them, that can yeah. interrogate yeah. them, yeah. can yeah. ask yeah. them. Yeah. They feel that yes. you, you are a woman and how dare you ask how us dare. kind of these but questions. But one question but now, a question are changing. Changing. you have to answer the words, hmm. things are changing. But she has said so and obviously she's felt it, so hmm. yes it happens. Yeah. No, it happens all right, but once the question comes, then you have to forget that a woman asked it. Yeah. Then you have to answer so the question. So times are changing. Times are changing, times but are it's changing. happening. It's there is this push and pull that's taking place. Sandeep, what, what would you have to say to that? I don't know. I haven't really encountered this, you know. I mean, as you say, maybe the first question might put the man yeah. off, but when he sees that you are handling it properly, you are responding to it, and you are asking the right uh, supplementary questions, and, uh, and, and he feels that he has an attentive uh, listener, and, and he knows that what he's saying is going to be reported properly, I don't, I, I really don't see this. Probably it might be there in, le in electronic, but I've never worked in the electronic. In print, I'm mm. okay with it. <laughs> mm. You know, because uh, of course we can always say that women have, have to ha fight and get in there. But a lot of our male colleagues also, while I was uh, working for this uh, discussion, they were saying, you know, actually it's very easy for the women. To at least go, your first round is pretty easy. No, you know, I'll tell you what. It actually works to the woman's advantage in the sense that we have more freedom to report what a source has told us because yes. with a man you know the chap for instance he might have shared a cigarette with him or a drink with mm, him like yes. as you mm, said mm. and okay he's got more information out of him but there are uh, nine times out of ten the chap will say Are ye mat lagana, ye ye mat, uh, but he'll never say that to a woman so whatever information you've got from a particular person mm. you are free to report it as you <laughs> wish to it actually works to our advantage I've seen because very mm. few people will actually you know turn mm. down and say oh don't, don't use this because they don't get too familiar with you the mm. way they would with a so, man. So does that work to your advantage or disadvantage? Works, not getting too familiar, not getting the right story. Works, Maybe yeah, for a man. It's not the right story. See, mm. getting you more in the story. You get, you get your story. I've seen. Once you've demonstrated, like I told you, hmm. that you are here to do a job. And hmm. then the person at the other end is confident that whatever information is given to you will be used properly, will not be distorted. Hmm. And will find its place in your magazine or hmm. newspaper or wherever. wherever. Hmm. He'll give you the same information which he'll give to a man whom he knows better. Mm. You know, mm. it, it. I mean, at the end of the day, whoever's giving you news, he's motivated. He's got an interest mm. in giving it to you. Mm. But yes. but the chances are that he'll tell the man that listen, just you know, ye nahi karna. Shayad but quickly, up. Yeah. Uh, मुझे लग रहा है कि सोर्स बनाना शायद अब थोड़ा मुश्किल है. मेल के लिए ज़्यादा आसान होता होगा, लेकिन जो उसका जो trust female journalist पे होता है क्योंकि I think it's not a gender thing. बहुत बार ऐसा होता है. Okay. जो तक what would you say? I, 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 would say there are, I would say there are disadvantages and there are advantages, but because of the baggage that we have currently, the balance is slightly in favor of men, but the balance is tilting slowly and I think it's going to get me. Because now the funny realize that women, the funny realize that women need to be taken seriously in this profession. It's not a question of finally. It's not a question. It's, it's been happening over the last 10 to 20 years. It's not that we've come upon it now. Well, okay. Thank you so much. That's all the time we have for now. But I have a very interesting close, which is she's everywhere on television screens now, anchoring, reporting, who holding fort, but it's not been an easy ride for women journalists. It still isn't, especially in smaller cities. Media institutes have come everywhere. They are more role models for young aspiring women journalists than ever before. What would perhaps help is telling them the truth on day one. Journalism is a commitment like most jobs are, but it also calls for a different vibe, not giving up.